President Biden made a rare Oval Office address tonight after speaking about national unity earlier today. CBS's Nancy Cordes reports from the White House. In just his third Oval Office address since taking office, President Biden called for an end to political violence. There is no place in America for this kind of violence, for any violence ever, period. No exceptions. The president was briefed in the Situation Room by his national security team this afternoon. He said he has instructed the FBI to be thorough and swift as it investigates the shooter. I urge everyone, everyone, please, don't make assumptions about his motives or his affiliations. Let the FBI do their job. With the Republican National Convention set to start tomorrow, President Biden said he has directed the head of the Secret Service to review all security plans for the four-day event. And as questions swirl about how the shooter was able to get so close to a presidential candidate, Biden said he had ordered an independent review of rally security to assess what went wrong. Security around the White House is still elevated, with pedestrians blocked from Pennsylvania Avenue and Lafayette Park across the street. President Biden has postponed a planned trip to Austin, Texas tomorrow, and the Biden campaign has hit pause on TV advertising as the president looks to strike a unifying tone. No matter how strong our convictions, we must never descend into violence. The president added that he has directed the Secret Service to provide Mr. Trump with every protective measure he needs to ensure his continued safety. Nora. Nancy Cordes at the White House, thank you very much.